we're looking at character. I mean, this is really about leadership character. It's about what they've done. To take someone and to choose someone out of all the college players in the country, um, it's the first kind of its award in tennis that we've had. The thing that came out to me when we were going through this process of selecting someone for this award was that he wasn't the best player, that he was the best leader, that he had the most grit. From day one when I stepped foot on Duquesne's campus, I knew I had to push myself really hard. I could tell that we needed leadership in the school and I just thought it was best if I stepped up and took on that role. For me, going to Duquesne, um, seeing different parts of the country, being able to live in the city, it was very different than where I grew up. Um, I was very fortunate growing up and uh, had a lot of blessings. And when I was able to encounter some people, maybe in the city of Pittsburgh, that didn't grow up as fortunate as I did, um, it kind of sparked this change in me to do something about it. So I tried to get as involved, uh, get my team involved. I said, guys, we have to get out in the community. We need to show people that Duquesne cares. All of our you know, efforts that we did in the community while I was uh, at Duquesne, um, I really got a lot out of it. It you know, gave me a new perspective you know, to see people with you know, that maybe weren't as fortunate as I was growing up and being able to bring tennis to them, um, that was so rewarding for me. It's really nice to know that you know, my efforts have been recognized and the main thing is it just doesn't stop here. I'm gonna keep pushing in the community, um, no matter where I am, uh, just to keep using tennis sports um, to bring communities together.